on everybody it's brian with you from the game Common, and we are playing some more civilization 6 we are continuing with our england let's play and yeah first episode went okay uh we ended up taking over yerevan uh we found ourselves at war with scythia and it was actually by my choice um and i think we're gonna be okay uh she does have a quite a bit larger army than me 204 compared to 105 so almost double my army size uh, but because of this little snake here she's not really going to be able to uh, use the full extent of her troops at least early on until we start getting some later technologies um we are still working for our oracle and i think i'm going to actually move our builder over here because what we want to do is we actually want to put our oracle here and i'm gonna have to tear down the forest so i think my initial plan is with your last charge i'm going to rip up this forest and then I am going to pop out a builder as soon as we finish the trader and then uh, with that builder then we can start tearing down uh, you know the forest here the forest there and I think we will after irrigation go for bronze working so we can tear down this rainforest there uh, so I think that's going to be our plan hopefully that's going to give us enough production to get the oracle we shall see uh, as for now let's go ahead and hit next turn uh, you are going to attack my warrior. Okay, that actually did quite a bit of damage. I think I need to put you up on the hill just to help protect you. Uh, you're going to be at really low HP after I get the two shots in here, though. You might actually just come suicide in my archer. So with you, I'm going to go grab you. I don't know if we're going to be able to hold this city, because uh, loyalty is going to be a bit of an issue, but sure. Sure. Uh, so we want to go grab a builder, please. Thank you. Uh, with our trader, we're going to send you to Yerevan, and I'm saying trader, T-R-A-D-E-R, not T-R-A-I-T-O-R. -R. You know, I play a lot of, or we used to play before I moved, we used to play a lot of Secret Hitler, so it's like, trader, you're the trader, I guess. Even before that, we used to play a game called Resistance, which, um... I highly recommend both of those games if you have a lot of friends who like yelling at each other. Um, okay, so you lived, luckily, uh, and you have a promotion available, so good, 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 good. So you're going to definitely live, so we need to kill this guy for sure. And, oh god, you're going to live with, what, 6 HP? Uh, so we will have to use you to kill him. I should have actually shot with him first, because he can actually shoot this guy, so yeah. Whatever, slight misplay. Uh, you're going to move up on the hill, we're going to go ahead and purchase this tile. Uh, what tiles are you guys currently working? You should be working here instead of there. I don't care so much about the growth. Go ahead and get the little extra production. Um, doesn't really matter for what we were doing before, but for now, yeah. Yeah, slow that growth down a little bit. Um, we are going to be able to grab a, a governor here in a little bit. One thing I should note, uh, I did debate about, hey, maybe we should rush out grabbing Magnus. Uh, so when we tear up these tiles, we get a better boost. Um, they did, however, nerf Nat Magnus in the last update. So instead of 100% yields from Plot Harvest, now you only get a 50% yield. So it's not nearly as good. Um, so I'm not sure who our first governor is going to be. Might be Ling, because we might want the plus one build charge. Also, 30% production towards city center seems good, and government plaza buildings. Uh, however, 20% growth in your city, and trade routes get plus two food is also good. And we might end up putting him in leads. Now, the thing is, we might also need the loyalty over here in cool, uh, cool Oba. But, like I said, I don't know what's going to happen in this city. I don't know. We might just rip the city up because it's not a particularly great one. The problem is, we are kind of falling behind a little bit because we need uh, we need to grab some uh, settlers. But we haven't been grabbing settlers because, well, hey, uh, we've been kind of busy. So, uh, I'm going to move you up and we're going to shoot with you. And then I can actually then promote you. And with that plus five range strength, that should actually be able to kill uh, uh, kill his horse archer if he brings another one forward. We will heal you for the time being. Yeah. Yeah, I might actually move you here and then move you here so I can shoot the city next turn. So in that case, you're not actually going to get any heals, so we might as well do a little bit of damage to the city. And then you should be healing. Uh, as for, um, we're going to do free inquiry for our dedication. I feel like the Eurekas are so much easier to get than the Inspirations. Uh, inspirations are like, found a religion, or, you know, build a wonder, and weird stuff like that, where, you know, the Eurekas are pretty easy, usually. Build a quarry. That's not hard. You know, build a pasture. And eh, that might be a little harder. B uh, improve two sea resources. Get two galleys. I mean, we're going to get all those. So, uh, as for our next tech, we want to grab bronze working, because I need to tear down rain forest tiles uh we did actually finish um the oracle so hopefully this is going to give me the builder straight away it gives me 34 production 
So if we had Magnus, that would be an additional 50. So, okay, back in the day, uh, before Magnus was nerfed, we would be getting uh, 34 plus 34, so we'd be getting 68 total production. Which, Wonders Oracle is, let's see, what is it? 290. Ooh, so 6, 12, 18, 24. So four, basically ripping up four tiles would almost be enough to get the Wonder straight away. <laughs> now, we'd be getting, what? what is it, 34? 34 plus 17 would be uh, 51. So three of those, one, two, three, would be a lot. That'd be 150, which means we'd need about 140 left. Although this one's actually going to the builder, so never mind. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. We got you straight away, so let's go bring you there, and we can start tearing you down. And then we are going to grab the oracle on that tile, please. And we want to make sure we are production focused, which we are cool. We want to put a mine there, but um, next we also can build a uh, buy a builder here in a little bit, which we might do. So I think we're going to grab early empire first so I can get the production towards settlers. Builders. We're not going to be producing builders anytime soon, so no, let's go for settlers. I may want to produce a settler in Eurovin next, because we are kind of falling behind a little bit. Oh, let's actually look at our policies. Uh, experience. Naval units is nice, but I can't really do anything. I can't move any of you guys up there, so uh, we just have plus one production. Yeah, we just don't have any particularly great stuff right now. So we can get two uh, gold, but nah, nah, nah. And so yeah, early empire. Uh, we can send another envoy, so <laughs> another envoy, our first envoy. We're going to send it to Hatsuya just so we can get a little bit more science. Which actually is going to help us. Yeah, it's going to help us get our inspirations. Well, not necessarily, but... It's going to help us uh, at least uh, not fall too far behind in science. Uh, remember, we're going cultural. So, science isn't as important to me, but long term it is. So, we will move you here to heal you. Two archers should be enough to bring this health down. Yeah. Wow, you actually do a lot of damage now. I like you upgrading. Uh, you're going to rip you up. So we're down to 19 turns. Yeah, we're going to need like 10, 11 turns, I think, once you rip up all these tiles. It's going to be close. I don't know if we're going to be able to do it. I'm going to really hope we can, but we'll see. We'll see. Let's go ahead and move you over here. We actually... Is that another continent? That is another continent. It was foreign trade, wasn't it? Yeah, so we already missed it. We discovered a new continent. Namely an amnesia. <laughs> I, I don't think that's what it was called. I'm gonna call it amnesia. Amnesia. I like amnesia better. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna call it amnesia. Ah, uh, we found Lur uh, Lutaro. What's up? Honored to meet you. Exchanging capital ideas is a great idea. Can we see where his capital is? Yes, we can. Oh, you're way over there. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah, seriously. Okay. Let's put you up here. Let's go over there. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Uh, hi. Okay. I want the delegation. Can we be friends? No. I should actually be friends with you. Yeah. Let's be friends there because we might be able to get an alliance here with you, uh, which I think is going to be okay. Maybe do a cultural alliance or something like that. Uh, although your culture is probably pretty trash because you usually go for science. Uh, I don't think there's anything else we can do. We met you. We got plus one era score. London needs housing to keep growing. Yeah. Yeah, I can't really do anything about that. You can move there, and then we'll start ripping you up. Unfortunately, sending the guy is going to make it a little harder for us to buy a builder. 230. It's going to take a few more turns, but I think we're still okay. Also, I hate that freaking sound. That sounds the same sound as a wonder, so I'm always a little worried when I hear it. Another 34. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Let's get you up there. Uh, we got 15 turns, so we're definitely knocking it out. You guys both are getting healed. I'm going to save your promotion probably for the time being. Let us bring you... Let's bring you down. I could come and explore over here and see what's over there, but I think let's come over here. Surely they got rid of the barbarian encampment by now. Surely. Surely. Don't call me Shirley. Okay, good. <laughs> ah, that's scary, man. Freaking hack, dude. All right, keep shooting. Keep shooting. You will do a little bit of damage, but let's hold off. Then we're going to move you up here. 
Archer's available for promotion. Cool. We already knew that, actually. Oh, I want his builder. I can't move into... You know what we need to grab next? I might want to rush forward to shipbuilding. Two galleys. Man. Here's the problem. I don't think I'm going to be able to take her cities. Because uh, A, she has a larger military than me. But number one, two, I'm going to have to move through uh, the Snake of Death. <laughs> so... I really feel like if we have any hope of taking our cities, it's going to be with galleys. So I may want to start popping out as many galleys as possible here in a little bit. We are going to want to probably grab the production towards... We can also get plus two loyalty for garrisoned units. Hmm. Hmm. We might want to grab that one. I just don't know. I don't know if we're going to be able to hold this city. We're also going to be able to get a governor. So if we put a governor there, who would we give? Lang gives us build charges, which I don't think we're ever going to be able to finish. Magnus, I think, would be good over here in Leeds. Obviously, he's too late over here. But over here in Leeds, we might be able to uh, pop some good stuff out. Because uh, we can get, what, 34? And then I don't think removing the rainforest uh, is worth as much. But And then we also have a couple more. So we could definitely rush out um, some units over here. Uh, maybe some galleys. Which would get me shipbuilding. But I need another builder for that to happen. We will be able to buy a builder. And we'll want to build the mine. And then we could send him over there. And then just rush for... Means we're not going to be able to hold Kuoba. Depending on the loyalty. Let's see what the loyalty ends up. If it's like eight or something like that, then I may have to put him over here. Unfortunately, you're not really going to be able to get any yields, so that's going to be a bit of a downside. But uh, for the time being, it should be okay. Um, we already attacked with both of you, so I'm just going to move you here. Doesn't really matter. I can move you here, shoot the city. Actually, probably not because of. Yeah, I probably can't because of the stupid. You got a lot more HP. Yeah, because there's a hill there. So I'm going to have to put you there to shoot, which is a little unfortunate. Uh, we'll see if we actually want to do that. So then do I want to rush out shipbuilding? I think let's grab writing first. Astrology does nothing for me. We probably could grab a religion, <laughs> especially if we get the Oracle. Might not be the worst thing in the world, but eh. plus one production. I think I need to hold on to. It's not a lot, but it's enough because we're doing a wonder. We could do plus two loyalty. We're not actually doing any naval units right now, so I think let's grab the loyalty. Just in case. We'll see how that ends up working out. We need more housing. Uh, we have enough now to purchase ourselves a builder. Cool. You're gonna come over here. You're gonna actually rip this dude up. That was only 19, so okay, it's not worth nearly as much. I still think we're gonna go with Magnus next. Yeah, even highly nerfed Magnus. Uh, I could build on the ba bananas, but that's just gonna give us gold. Uh, I always forget this, but uh, building a um, plantation gives you gold, at least early on. Gives us housing, which is nice, um, but gold. And I really just want straight production right now. So that's why I think we're going to go mine, and I think we're going to go up here and then start uh, doing the production stuff over here. Uh, uh, like, going hard for a builder. What is your production looking like? 3.1. If we worked on the cattle and the truffles, the truffles are... Truffles are a camp too, right? Improved by a camp, so that's going to give us production. So both of those would actually give me productions. So maybe that's better than actually tearing up the city. Unless, of course, we wanted a builder. We could tear up the city to get another builder to then build for more production. <laughs> See, that's where it's kind of like, I don't know if that works. So maybe we save uh, a Magnus for a little later, especially if we're using him over here on cool. But we already shot with you. So what are we trying to do? You want a Civic. Um, let's go Craftsmanship. Production towards builders might be fine. We might want to grab a builder here in Euro then. Because you definitely have some tiles to improve. The other thing, after writing, we might just want to straight rush out mathematics. And grab the Petra. That might actually be more important than shipbuilding. 
Yeah, I think getting the Petra and Yurovin is going to be better. Okay. Let's see. Can we kill you without moving this archer into a compromising position? I'm a little worried about going into that dial. Not going to lie. It looks like we can actually grab you. I hate you so much, game. So freaking much. Ugh. That's fine. She wants a piece. Sorry. We're not going to have any peace. I might peace you out after I take the city. We shall see. All right, let's put you up on the hill. You can see a little bit better. Uh, okay, so let's look at the city. So you're losing a lot of loyalty per turn right now. You're losing 12 loyalty per turn. We got plus two because we have a military unit there. Uh, putting a governor there is going to give us eight loyalty in addition, which, speaking of which, we never actually um, gave ourselves a governor. So you're still going to lose loyalty. How else can we improve loyalty here? Okay, well, let's think about it. So we're at negative 12 right now. We get a governor. We're going to be at negative four. We build a monument. We're going to be at negative three. Is there anything else early on that gives us loyalty? I don't think so. Uh, just our other city's growing. Although you're really not going to grow until we get another builder here. I hate the fact that we have a freaking holy site there. But yeah, let's keep it. Let's keep it. And you know what? I'm going to put Magnus here. So let's go ahead and point you over here into... Cool Oba, which is going to put us a negative four per turn, which is decent. Then we need a monument. God, I wish you had a force that I could rip up. I could buy up to here. I could buy these two tiles <laughs> and then tear it down just to get my monument. Probably not worth it. Probably not worth it. Also, you're not going to grow because you're occupied. Cool. Do we want to peace out Scythia? I feel like we might want to peace her out. I wonder what kind of deal we can get. Why can't you move there? Hmm. Is this fortify? Thank God. <laughs> You're going to pay me for open borders. I'm cool with that. Thank you. Did we send you a delegation? We did. And you still hate me. Well, that sucks. You're bringing a horse archer my way. Hi. What, kind, what would you give me for this peace deal? Do we have amenities? She will give me all her amenities. She will not give me 10 gold per turn. She will give me 4 gold per turn. I wonder if maybe getting all 198. No, no. We already have an elephant. So let's get rid of this, dude, and let's take the money instead. Yeah. yeah, yeah, okay, I'm cool with that. And then let's try 80. The problem is, I don't think we can actually win a war with her right now because there's no way we can get our troops up there. So um, we're just going to have to kind of chill for the time being. We could keep killing her units as she comes forward, but here's the thing. We might end up being friends with her long term. She's probably going to hate me, though, because I backstabbed her, and that's totally against her thing, too. So, oh, crap, we need you to seed the city. Okay, yeah. You want to give me these other cities? Okay, what are we at? We're at 7710. I mean, I guarantee this isn't going to work, but we can try. Uh, hold up. Peace. Give me You will not. She's just not willing to trade at all. Okay, that's fine. So, I just wanted to see. So, give me 78. Give me 10 gold. You and you and seed it was it eight gold might have been eight gold wasn't it It was nine gold okay okay can we go up to 79 yes 81 Ooh, 85 so what are we what are we doing different got you two we're seeing the city you will not take 10 gold per yeah this is actually better because the one extra gold for 30 turns is 30 gold Compared to, you know, an extra, what, 10 gold there. So, sure, 77, 10. Uh, we're going to get two amenities, which is hopefully going to make our cities a little happier. Uh, you are no longer occupied, so I don't know if that is going to change your loyalty. We're still at negative four, because she has some pretty freaking large cities there. Uh, you are growing now, which is good. The monument's going to also help. We got 12 turns to flip you around. I think I'm okay with that. I'm gonna bring you up here because we're at peace and we can come explore and 
you know, hopefully check out some of her land. Uh, we do want to start working on a settler here ASAP. Uh, you can come back over here. And I think we might as well bring you over here to see what's going on in that direction. Uh, you, we can come move over here into Yurvin. Not that Yurvin needs any uh, people. And then you're just going to chill. Actually, you know what? I shouldn't move you too far away just in case uh, Kuloba flips. Yeah, so I don't know if I really want to take you over in that direction. Nah, nah. Yeah, just in case you flip. Wake up. I want you to fortify. Uh, okay, you're going to build a mine. And then we're going to move you over here and grab our production bonuses for leads because we really need to work on our production over there obviously we can grab the cattle here not that big of a deal you're the hanging garden still okay okay we got five turns left oh we're so freaking close man we're so freaking close i think let's roll with it i think let's roll with it it's a little cheap but i'm gonna quick save because if we lose it i may end up buying this tile and ripping up the forest because we can totally grab this oracle i think that's gonna help us so much long term Let's grab state workforce. Flanking doesn't help me right now. And heavy and light cavalry units doesn't help me. So yeah, state workforce. And then we can go into political philosophy. As for Yervin, I think we want to grab. Oh, God, I hate it. I hate it. I think we're going to grab a builder first. And then we're going to grab, let's see, in four turns, then we'll grab the Settler. I think that's our plan. I mean, 14 turns on a Builder, which is stupid. 30%, I don't think it's going to be enough. What's our money at? 143 plus 25 per turn. Which means... Here's the thing. So we can buy another Builder then in four turns. 245, yeah five turns but still we could buy a builder in five turns so maybe it's just better for us to go straight settler and then straight settler 22 i don't think that it, I, I don't think that's cut in half yet no that was cut in half all right well that's gonna be a really slow time but that'll be okay because we're gonna buy and that's going to give me more growth. We could actually put a couple mines up here, which might not be bad either. What citizens are you working on right now? Oh, God, you just need to grow. Yeah, because we actually get the stone over here, too. Hmm. Yeah, okay. Okay. You come over here. I want to see what's going on over here. I'm assuming that's our capital. You are flipping in 11 turns, so we still got a little bit of time. We might actually need to buy the monument over here. 240. Ugh... You should be happy, correct? Yeah, you have plenty of amenities, which is should be giving me more loyalty. Yeah, six from happiness levels. Dang, that's pretty crazy. So I almost don't want any of my other cities to grow then, <laughs> just so we can get it. Uh, okay, you're going up there. Uh, you're at five turns. So freaking close. How have you not killed this encampment, dude? We have open borders with you, so that's good put you here for the time being might want to move you up just in case we'll see hopefully he doesn't trap me in because that is a possibility now that i think about it you might want to move up here and make sure he doesn't trap me in because that would be very bad especially if the city flips all right let's bring you over here he did finally get the encampment cool three turns god we're so freaking close we're so freaking close and we can't see anything. And we don't have open borders. All right. It's all good. It's all good. You're there. That's fine. Our road is finished over there. So remember, if we send a trader out up here, we're going to get plus two food. Uh, actually, no, you're not leveled yet. But as soon as we level him. He's almost fully established. Can we move over here? We can. Good, good, good. Want to see what's going on. We have more housing. We met Georgia. Okay. 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 I'm so like nervous every time I hit the button because I just don't want your established cool because I just don't want us to lose this wonder at this point. Even though that you're established, we're still going a little too slow. I really feel like we might just purchase the monument. I hate it. I do hate it. 
think we're going to promote you. I think we're going to get the trader out. I'm not going to work on industrial zone. Settlers do not consume a population. Wait, what? We can't actually promote you? Oh, we got one more turn. I'm stupid. <laughs> we finished currency, not that one. Uh, we finished currency. No, we didn't. We didn't finish anything. What am I thinking? I don't know what I'm thinking. Okay, so you're still going up there. Let's go next turn. You saw all that you could see, so cool. We'll move you guys down. Got eight turns, man. Wealth consists not in having great. It is equally. All right, so we got plus one error score. Because I completed our first technology from the new. Uh, okay. I think I. <sighs> so here's the thing. I can get more production here by buying a builder, or I can make sure we get a monument. The problem is you're still going to flip. It's just going to be a little slower because we're at negative four. So in that case, I think let's get the builder. Because if that C is going to flip, it doesn't matter. 245. <laughs> Freaking one gold off. Yeah, because we said five turns. <laughs> uh, yeah, you're fine. You're coming over here. I'd we'll love to actually move you through the city. You decided to go that way, so sure. And we will go ahead and promote you and grab plus 20% growth in the city. I wish trade routes give you a little more. We could do... I mean, the settlers is nice because you don't consume. The problem is I think we have to be established to actually get that bonus. And we're not going to be established anywhere else. So let's just do the food. And we can get more food to... Uh, probably our capital, because we can send a trade out up there. We'll see. Uh, I don't know how much longer this trade out has. It shouldn't have many turns left. We could actually send a trade out all the way up to Paz. I don't think we want to, though. Uh, so we got a little bit better roads now, and Leeds needs more housing. Okay. You really need to get your production up, which is what we're trying to get. I sprang upon the oh my god, we did it! The form of a dolphin. Yes! Pray to me as Apollo Delphinius. Also, the altar itself shall be called Delphinius. So now we can buy great people for less faith. Also, we're getting uh, plus two great person points per turn for anything in this, uh, in here. So we definitely want to get a cultural hub up in here. Up in here. Uh, I guess I'm going to have to put it here. Yeah, it's not going to be a great spot. But. I definitely, unless I put it here and get rid of our elephant, which is kind of crappy. But we will have more ivory there, so I don't know. All right, so London, what are we going to do? I think we need to start popping out galleys. I think this is pretty uh, important for us. So I would love to switch the settlers. The loyalty, I can't switch. Also, didn't we not just finish you? Well, that was last turn. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. So maybe we want to pop out another settler then. Yeah, let's pop out another settler. I hate it. I hate it because we want to get to shipbuilding, but get two settlers over here. We can get some cities. I think that'll be fine. We can also put a city over here, which is going to be pretty trash. Here's the other thing. If we put a city over here, yeah, it's going to be a little trash, but it will help you from flipping as you grow. Unfortunately, you're just not going to grow. <laughs> uh, where would we put you to get the max amount of growth? One, two, one, two, three here. Are you going to suffer loyalty up here? One, two, three. I mean, right here is not a bad spot just because of all the resources you can get. Uh, however, every other tile you have in your city is going to be complete crap. So surely that isn't our best option. Let's try getting you up here. Let's try getting you over here. Because once again, remember, we want to sit here. You're no longer growing, which sucks. That's fine. I mean, really, in the scheme of things, keeping this city isn't our priority. I think getting two cities down that are better is probably a better priority. Freaking heck, man. Hate not being able to explore. Uh, okay, she sent a trade delegation. Uh, okay. She like me? She doesn't hate me. Maybe shouldn't have accepted it? We totally forgot to buy a builder. Oh, we need one more turn. Yeah, we should have bought it last turn. So we did screw that up. That's okay. Uh, I think we want another settler. Yeah. It's gonna take forever. 
Eh, maybe not so much. Once we get a camp up over there. Yeah, that won't be too terrible. So then you're going to come up here. You're going to come over here. And I'm going to put you up there. You needed to buy a settler last turn. Or a builder, rather. Then we're going to grab probably the mine first. Just get more production. And then we'll grab the fish. Maybe turtles and fish. Turtles are fishing boats, right? I mean, imagine. Turtles are improved by fishing boats. Fishing boats give you food and housing. Uh, I don't think you're suffering housing issues. It doesn't look like it. Okay, how long have we been going, by the way? We're at 30 minutes. Yeah, we should wrap this episode up. So things are going well for us. Um, we are going to pop out a bunch of cities next episode. We have three currently being built. Um, this says 17 turns, but it will be significantly less once we get the builder up here. The other option, too, is we could send our builder over here and rip up the forest just to knock you out a little bit quicker. From there, I think we're going to go ahead and work on... You know, I think I might actually do that. Unfortunately, it's going to take a little long for you to get over there. I think from there, then we're going to start working on our ships. Uh, and uh, we have the Petra incoming, too, in 13 turns. So now, I should really get your production as high as possible. What uh, what tile what does the Petra require? Petra. Is it Flatlands? Must be built on desert floodplains without hills. So really, any of these three tiles. If we were going to build a theater district, theater square, there's no restrictions on it, right? Yeah, I don't think districts ever have requirements. So I was wondering about putting the theater square here and then put the wonder there. That might not be a bad idea. I was thinking about theater square here and then you there. Um... Petra's plus two food, plus two gold. So, and then one production. So I think I would rather keep our theater square off the hill if possible. I can actually put an industrial hub here. It's not great. Or industrial hub here. Actually, industrial hub here. Uh, one, two, three. Yeah, industrial hub here so we can go. Okay, let's point this out, Brian. <laughs> uh, industrial hub. Industrial hub and district so industrial hub there because you're gonna get three mines which then means you need to stay a mine which is okay we could someday make this um if we have enough production we could actually make you the uh the really good uh, uh what, what's it called it's the industrial one industrial i can't think of the wonder name the Ruhr Valley, potentially. But that's a long freaking way away. Ruhr Valley. 20% uh, production must be built along a river. Nope, we can't do it. Never mind. Yeah, you'd have to go here. Eh, eh. So then I think we want to put Wonder here, put the Petra here, and then I think we're going to do the, uh, the Theater Square here. And then the Theater Square is going to actually get the double bonus. The downside with the Industrial Hub here is unless we build a commercial hub here, that's not going to be that great. And we kind of really want a harbor here. So maybe we don't want an industrial hub here. But if we did build one, hmm. Okay, so then let's look at that. If we built the harbor here, we could build then commercial hub here, even though it's not going to be next to the river. And then theater square here. It's going to be a really big city. And yeah. So I think we'll go here and here. I know I'm taking way too long to decide this. So anyways, uh, we're gonna wrap the episode up here. Hope you guys are enjoying it. Did I do the outro already? It's been too long. But anyways, hit the like, comment, let me know. And I'll see you guys next episode. Later.